I fully take the blame, dear reader. It is I who, it could be said, is making Newfoundland better known to Newfoundlanders. The lion's share of you wouldn't know the barrel man from the boogeyman if it were not for this, my free and inadvertent publicity. And for I thought that, it was fabulous. I'm always, I've seen it three times now. It's so moving and, you know, as a Newfoundlander, it's kind of hard because you feel like, oh, did we sell our country, you know? And I think the script is beautiful and, like, yeah, I really enjoyed it. Your sayings, your local customs, your philosophical musings, for God's sake, anything. And Joey Smallwood was a quintessential Newfoundlander and Canadian, and his character developed into being the premier he became after 1949. And I tell you, the ending made me, made me cry. Well, you know what they say? There's no such thing as bad press. Fielding lives and breathes. I think audiences should come see the show because it's an interesting play. It, it kind of runs the gamut. It's funny, it's sad, it's engaging. I think it's a really well-rounded night out at the theater. I mean, you, you laugh, you cry, and you learn a lot, too. It's funny. Some people, and some of them are living among us, don't think much of Newfoundland or of Newfoundlanders. Some people would rather I not spend this time with I you I loved it. I couldn't wait for the next act to start. I'm serious. That was great. Yeah. Highly recommended. They find their way to listen. That we are a people who will always succeed every time we are given... By the end, you'll be deeply moved, and I think you'll understand Newfoundland and Labrador's place in Canada much better as an Ontarian, certainly, than I, I did than before. So just a tremendous, tremendous performance. With recent grave word of the German invasion of Poland, a lot of people are wondering what this will mean for Newfoundland. Yes, Mr. Mayor. You follow this romance through four decades, and it reveals a mystery. And nestled inside of that is the history of this character's rise to fame and his huge determination to present the country of Newfoundland as a strong, useful, independent place. Mm -hmm. It would seem true friendship may always go unrewarded. In fact, it may be punished. Keep up the good work, Mr. Barrowman. You need only read your field day every Saturday to see so. This show is fabulous. It was beautifully staged and just, just a gorgeous show. I loved it. I learned history that I didn't know before, and uh, it was a fabulous Canadian production. I was so happy to see it. Everyone should come. Thus concludes the Barrelmen for today, friends. Thank you for your stories, your letters, and questions. Join us tomorrow, and yes, every weekday evening, as we endeavor to make Newfoundland better known to Newfoundlanders. <laughs>